I'm an engineer, my father was an engineer, our whole families are engineers. And I talked to my son, who had been going to engineering school, mechanical engineering, and he loved USC, so he came here. And about six weeks into the program, he called me up and he said, Dad, you said engineering was fun, and we're not having much fun here. And I said, well, don't they have some things like Cornell, where I went to school, has an SAE race car team? A couple of weeks later, he calls me up. He said, I got a lot of the guys together and we want to build a race car. I said, great. And then about a week later, they called and they said, the only problem is we need some money. So I wrote my first check, the first of many checks other than tuition checks for USC. And that's when the entire team concept started coming around. The design teams and hands-on activities do have a long history in Viterbi, uh, dating back decades, because a lot of engineering is trying to figure out solutions to problems that you haven't read in a textbook. Scientists discover the world that is, engineers create a world that never was. How do you go from ideas and knowledge into skills, mindsets, and impact? We have rocket teams and car teams and aerodynamic teams and biomedical device teams. The students are spread out all over campus making their cement boats and their solar cars and their rockets. Everything was calling for something new where we can put all of this together. They really didn't have good space. So it was an opportunity to really renovate the science and engineering library and provide space for the wonderful creations the students produce. We had big dreams. We had big dreams for what we wanted to create here that was unique to Viterbi. Then the question was, how do we secure the funds to be able to convert that? Mr. Baum coming forward to give us the naming gift, and that just starts the snowball of others who see this as something that's really going to happen, really made it a reality. I jumped in the bandwagon right away. It brings that other part of the package of the education to the table, and when we graduate a USC engineer, they're much better off for it, I think. The Baum Family Makerspace is a place for our students to go to fabricate things. It can be classroom associated or it can be part of a design team, it can just be individual work. The center facility is what we call the workshop. It has about 20 large workbenches in there that students can sit at and do their work. We have an area that's cordoned off and this is the area that we'll be doing sanding and grinding operations. We have a large walk-in freezer, we have a wet lab for teams that are using chemicals. The Advanced Fabrication Lab is where we do our 3D printing. Right now we have two large Stratasys 3D printers in there. These can be used to fabricate pretty much anything you want. We have a machine shop. We have a Haas milling center, computer controls. We have a Omax water jet cutter. We have three older milling machines. And we have three lathes for doing turning work. We have two outdoor patio areas. These are gonna be used for welding or mixing concrete. We have a dynamometer room where the race team can roll their car in there. And we also have a student design area. We have a number of teams that are gonna be in there. So it'll be sharing space. We wanna get them in a room where they can hopefully collaborate with each other. And if one person's having a problem with one thing, they can get some help from somebody else. There's so many things that overlap with other design teams. Just knowledge from more people with different experiences would be really valuable. We're really excited to move in there and just see what other teams are working on and we can always collaborate together. We put a lot of focus on all the math and physics, but at the root of it all, it's all about working together. And I think that's what engineering is about. The goal of the teams is to create something which is common to everyone. It's an orchestra, this is not a solo player. The best way to learn is through failure, and the best way to learn from other people is to get that feedback. We can make these mistakes together as a group and learn as a group. There are skills you learn in a collaborative environment that you don't necessarily learn when you're working on your own project. One of the most appealing things to me is the team spirit that we have on the team. I like to think of the racing team as my Trojan family within my Trojan family. They often build communities, they make friends, uh, sometimes lifelong. It's just like a huge bonding experience. Like we're truly bonding over our education and over the experience that we're gaining from this team. The students that participate in these teams, they're very sought after for positions because they come to a company already understanding how this kind of teamwork happens. See, these are not a bunch of kids. These are real engineers working on a project and presenting it right. The way you would do it at USC is, is the best way to do it.